All right, everything seems fine. So let's go ahead and continue the game, everybody. More infinite fusion. I got Surf last time by beating Sabrina. We got on the Whalmer. And I put Teleport on this thing to train up. I kind of want to go over to Seafoam. See if I can get, get, like, the Legendary Bird or something. Or at least see the trainers along the way. Wait, is that a dive spot? I tried diving for Pokemon, but it was a no-go. Well then. Apparently there's more to the ocean this time around. No problem. Let's get ourselves some experience before we fight Blaine. Giovanni was quite a bit of a jump in levels. Even a Zuma King almost got killed there. A Star Cruel. Reminds me of a Toad Scroll. Still has no defense. Not at all. Anyways. I keep forgetting how like loud the battle music becomes compared to the other stuff. Is it too loud for you guys? Let me know. My swimsuit is made of the finest polyester. I can dive there, but... Oh, jeez. I don't like that. Get rid of it. Polyester gotta go. And stand a chance. Not too loud for you. Sounds alright. Okay. And what do we got here? Climb the ice wall with the ice pick. Okay, didn't realize I had that. When did I pick up an ice pick? There's a Krabby. I want to see some more Absol fusions later as well. Is that for pushing a boulder? Probably. Uh, can I only approach it from the bottom? There's a Shelter. Probably see about that. Got one Master Ball. I'm gonna just eat this at ya. There we go. I know I can go to the power plant too. I'll check that later. I want to catch the three legendary birds because um, those three would make for the best fusions, especially for making a thumbnail. Oh, come on. All I did was turn in place and then back to the left. Big Pearl. And what do we got? Not seeing any boulders around here. Huge power ain't gonna let that physical defense do anything for you. Oh, jeez. Are we suddenly playing, um, Crystal Kaizo again with this encounter eight? The music here is like a very low-pitched, uh, ice path from Gen 2. Ah, oh, come on. I always found it funny how the ice path was a completely overhauled location in Crystal. Unlike literally every other place. Okay, I see. If I mess this up, this happens. Hmm. Now then, how do I do that? Without hitting the ledge. Hmm. There we go. That's that there. Do I want to go that way? Hey, swine up! Don't really care to catch one of those, no. Alright. Can I... There we go. There's a TM over there. Now, how on earth do I get myself into position for that? I see. I have to. I have to approach from the over there. Over there. Hail! Ah, I'm never gonna use that. I'm never gonna use that at all. Okay, here's the path here. Uh, there's just a random Jinx chillin' there. Oh. Okay. That's an unfortunate combination of names. I'm gonna get rid of it.
Run away from the horsey. I can't really get on anything. Oh, I see Articuno. Yeah, it's down there. Holy crap. The encounter rate can be a bit annoying, but that's alright. A golster. It looks very unamused being in there. I can't quite tell if that one's custom or not. Let me adjust things a little bit more. Some of the Pokemon cries get really loud. I almost just accidentally closed the game, and that would have been very unfortunate. Anyways, I hope you're all having a ha wholesome little morning. Or afternoon, in my case. I usually stream this on Sundays, but I kind of decided to take yesterday off because I wasn't feeling super, super great. As many of you know, in fact, I believe it was during Infinite Fusion last week, I mentioned, like, getting, like, emergency alerts about a fire. There were, like, some wildfires going on in my region for pretty much the whole week. They're, they're pretty much under control now, but it was kind of... Kind of a wild situation there for a bit. Okay, slow poke. Hit that there. Don't need to catch everything. I just want the fun toy. That is Articuno. Hold up, is there anything over here? These sta these like tiles are weird. I can't go over there. Okay. Aha! Okay, we got it. Let's go ahead and make a save. Save to file B. And just because we can, go to file A. What means do I have for inflicting status to it? And T-wave it. That's about it. We'll do that. Yeah, listen to that music. Okay. Pressure, pressure, all is good. Ancient power. It should be able to take a psychic, for sure. Okay. Do another one. Okay. Moon ball, love ball, dust ball. That should count here, I hope. I'm not sure if the ice cave counts as a real cave. You never know if fan games, like, check all the boxes for this stuff or not. Come on. Usually just go to ultra balls anyway. Ah, oh, come on. Let's try ultras. Breaking free. Alright, perfect. That wasn't so bad. There we go. Legendary bird Pokemon that can control ice. The flapping of its wings chills the air as a result. It is said that when this Pokemon flies, snow will fall. Well, that's wholesome. It makes it snow. Okay, so I found this, but there's also a random Jinx. I wonder if I can only get that by approaching from the other entrance, though? Like, from the Fuchsia side. Let me go ahead and just switch to Azuma King here. Put you up there. I thought the music stopped for a second. We can combine all the legendary birds into cool stuff now. Jeez. I'm getting a few steps forward and then another battle. It's over here. Okay, an item. Rip the bat apart. Can't do anything. Free gold, if I need it. I may or may not need it, though. I wonder how far I can get today. Because we're at the point where I've explored most of Kanto, unless there's, like, another arbitrary, like, Team Rocket event before going to the Elite Four. A sea poke. It's kind of cute. But it's dead now. Okay. This takes me back to the entrance. Oh, come on. Is that an exit? It doesn't have, like, the light shining through. 
It is. So that is the other entrance. Okay, well, I can leave that Jinx alone for now. I don't really need it, need it, but... Let's go ahead and beat some stuff up. And get further. Isn't this great? The salty sea air, the wind blowing in your face? Because Giovanni was kind of a, a strange, like, level jump there, I want to make sure the team's all topped up when I go fight Blaine and all that. I can't imagine Blaine being scary. Oh, you got a Pika King. Oh, oh. That's that. That's a different kind of Pika King. Mine's cooler. Or rather, it's a Rai King now. I should probably be talking to swimmers. I don't think the swimmers are going to give me eggs. That's funny. Look at that. IVU. Anyways, yeah, chat. I hope you're all comfy today. It's actually raining out, which is good. It's been raining all weekend, which did kind of apparently help them out a lot with the fires. Ugh. Pretty tired out now, though. Oh, no, no, no. I don't want punishment. Give up on learning that. Wario. <laughs> okay. War Turtle? Yeah, because the other one was Charmeleon Ivysaur. Is this going to evolve? Yes, it is. Now we got Whale Lord Fusions. I can see a couple islands. We rematch? Nope. I just want to dive down under the sea. Want to rematch? I'll see you later then. These waters are treacherous. Goldeen. I'm actually starting very late today. Usually I take Mondays off, in fact, but I still wanted the stream today. Just because I usually do a long one on Sunday. That and I end up sleeping in pretty damn late, too. I needed the extra rest. Excellent. I got a cramp, Glub Glub. I love swimming. What about you? A sea bro. It's a bro at sea. Is it part psychic still? Yes, it is. Okay. Well, it can't be water water, so... Wait, you'll have a heart attack. Will I? I hope not. That wouldn't be very wholesome. I'm running out of slashes here. I should just put Genizard up front or something. Ah ha ha ha, I get it. I get it. <laughs> it's a Kingler, because it's Kingdra and Graveler. Oh, it's got Sturdy. I need more Ten Years of Fusions. Those would be nice, too. I look at the sea to forget. You're all just floating out here. That's not very safe. A Volt you. Azuma King cannot be stopped. Oh, traumatic. I look at the sea to forget. Rematch? No worries, I'll be here if you need the train up. Got a pearl. Just riding my whale. What's the matter? Are you afraid of getting wet? If Whale Lord is as huge as the Pokedex says, wouldn't that make, like, Whale Lord, like, larger than any of the islands I land on most of the time? That would actually be, like, a cool idea. A giant Pokemon where it just has, like, a whole, like, island on it. I mean, didn't, like, some of the Gigantamax forms do that? I think it was, like, Snorlax, yeah. But those were, weren't really, like, a thing in the wild, so to speak. They were just, like, you know, a one-time transformation in a stadium. Okay, hit that there. Send out the horsey. I'm comfy today. It's kind of chilly out now. After having a bit of a heat wave. And I got some hot cocoa. A starsala. Take it out. All warmed up. Hey, you look like you're pretty confident in your surfing skills. And how about a race to prove it? I'll give you something good if you can beat me. Come with me while I set up the race. Over here. Okay. Okay, this is the finish line. This looks really weird. You're not, like, on center of the tile. First person to complete two laps wins. Ready? Set. Go. Oh, jeez. Okay. I'm not beating this guy. 
I don't think I'm beating this guy. Oh my god, come on. I'm clearly trying to turn, and my character just, like, like spins in place. Sorry, you just weren't fast enough. Yeah, okay, whatever. I could see Koga and Jasmine watching. That dude's just straight up super speedy for me. Anyways, I should probably take the experience share off of you and put on Trap Inch so we can see Flygon fusions later. Let's take the Lucky Egg from you and put it on Genizard. I should have hit move there. Oh, come on. Switch. Okay. And then I surfed all the way there. Hmm. That's Mount Ember. I should be able to go directly to one island now, though, right? Hang on, let me first let me heal. Oops. We hope to see you again. Hey there, should I take you to Sevi Islands? Come on board, we're setting sail for one island. The Sevi Islands are comfy. Okay. This is just heart gold, so silver music and I hear now. Route music for a town is weird. Young people all want to go off to the big cities, but I want to stay here forever. Hi, sightseeing, are ya? Isn't the climate here great? Be cool to play, like, a fan game that's centered only on the Sevi Islands. Like, um, that'd be kind of cool, just having, like, the small island communities to go and explore, see what they can do with that. Closest I got to that was when I was completing the Pokedex in Fool's Gold, and I went between them all. Welcome to the Triple Battle Lounge. Today's theme is Plant Pokemon Prizes Big Mushroom. Yeah, no thanks. That's a Mega Lucario. Sometimes when you fuse two Pokemon of the same species, they will take on a different form. The synergy between the two makes them gain boost experience. I can make some jewels for you, but you have to provide the materials. There's also a small fee for them. I need a diamond necklace from you. One diamond, three pearls, one escape rope. Is that really... You can't just get a string from somewhere else. It has to be an escape rope. All right, here you go. Come back if you want some more. All right, I'll go back to the hotel later. Okay... So if I fuse two Lucario, I basically get Mega Lucario. Is that what it's trying to basically tell me? Some rare moves can only be taught to Pokemon that are fused in a certain way. For example, the move Shadow Bone can only be learned by Ghost-type Marowak fusions. Okay, that's a cool idea. Hello there, I'm the move expert. I can teach rare moves that your Pokemon wouldn't be able to learn. Two hard scales, but I'll do the first one for free. Are you interested what type of move I can teach your Pokemon? What about it? Okay, Zuma King can't get anything. What about Genizard? Heat Crash slams a foe with its flaming body. The heavier the user, the greater the damage. Trick or Treat. This user takes the target trick or treating. This adds Ghost type to the target's type. I don't remember these moves. Where are these from? Please come back. You can take a look at what the, the Gardatar learns. Psychic Terrain. Ew, I don't need Terrain. This isn't Emerald Rogue. Meryl. Peepa. I guess, yeah, like, something along a Sevi Island game that does something like the, uh, Pokemon Nightshade, where you're exploring, like, the little areas of the park. That'd be cool. Alright, heal me up, Joy. Who are you? You look different. Oh, you're a trainer. That means you're using boxes. My name's Bebe. You know the Pokemon PC boxes. I'm the system administrator in the Sinnoh region. I'm helping Celio install a new connection to Sinnoh's PC storage. We're almost done setting it up. He says he dropped it on Kindle Road when we he got spooked by a wild ponyta. What a disaster! What a disaster! I was attacked by a pack of ponyta on my way from Boone Island, and I lost the network chip. It's an essential component to the new communication system. This is terrible. A stranger from Hoenn sold me this egg, but I can't seem to hatch it. I'll give it to you for five heart scales. What a deal, I'll take it. That's exactly how much I have. What did I just what did I just buy off this dude? It looks like it will take a long time to hatch. Well, I guess I'm gonna carry it with me. Let's put the whale lord away. 
I don't suppose magma armor speeds that up, does it? Or flame body? Maybe I could take you along. Mm. It just has to be in the party, right? But I need teleport on Golit there. Okay. He crashes, just fire type, heavy slam. Okay. Okay. Put this away for now. Just carry it with me. Stranger from Minova sold me this egg. Oh. Too bad. Hey, I'll trade you. Oh, oh, I see. I see the grift going on here. I see how it is. What do you say? No worries. Art scales are often found. Used as a currency here in Sevi, so you better start saving them up. Those poor love discs. Hey, where'd you come from? Palatown? Don't know it. I'm the update man. Okay, don't need that. I might serve you DNA splicers, fusion incense. Let me buy some more ultra balls while I'm around here. Hang on. Maybe some max repels. Start using those later if I need to. Okay. Well, the egg will take a long time to hatch, and I'll come back for the Innova one another time. Uh, can I not surf? Oh, I'm supposed to walk there? That's weird. I can... Oh, I don't have Wailord with me. Duh. I only carry so much stuff. I don't want to waste putting Surf on Azuma King. Is there something else I have that I can train? That can learn Surf? There's Lapras, there's the Shelder, but I can just Waterstone that. Not, not that I really want to train here. Don't want to train the Zatu Fusion. I can't even defuse them. I can just take Wailord with me. Crying out loud and being too lazy with this. I'll hatch the damn egg later then. I need my HMs. Still having that, this problem in 2023, are we? Let me get a drink, yeah. Throat's dry. I'm beginning to get a sunburn. Psyduck is down. Where's the surfboard guy? Did I did I see him already? Because otherwise you shouldn't be spoiling stuff. Trap inch for level 20. R duck. That thing. Its face makes it look kinda auto. But I with that body, I don't think it is auto. Oh, the guy I raced? He wasn't on a surfboard. He was riding a Pokemon. Oh, you're so awful. I didn't interpret him as the surfboard guy. I'm actually supposed to beat him? That seemed like it was intentionally unwinnable, though, so I'm, I, I kind of don't know how I do that. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Oh, pardon me, jeez. What is Corsola doing? Aretha Corsola is blocking the way. What if I kick them? What are they going to do about it? Can you help me with my training? Mankey and Prime Millery. Ooh. Set that on fire. Slash that one. I'm gonna kick the Corsola and I'll turn them into a Cursula. Who's learning Crunch? Oh, you. That don't matter. That don't matter at all. Hmm. I could press on for here, or I could just leave this for later and go get Zapdos. Might be able to get some stuff around there anyway. Let's go to Rock Tunnel. Okay, good. Oh, hang on, what's this? Wild Charge. Okay, that might be useful. But Azuma King basically just solos everything. Wait, what? I can land there? 
It's clearly an elevated thing. Magnet stone. What's that? Oh, is this supposed to be for evolving into Magnezone? Why did they make this when uh, the, even the main games just made it a Thunderstone? It's for Provo Pass as well. Seems weird to me, but okay. I'll take it. Uh, I was, I'm stuck. This tile here is uh, impossible to go through. Let's check out the power plant. I'm sure it'll be fun. Only level 12, huh? To make it more fun, let me go ahead and use the fusion incense. How about that? Where is it? I know I had some of these somewhere. Okay. Oh, it's Electrode. Oh. No, it was a Voltor, but it played Electrode's Cry. Can't escape? Okay. A free repel. They're making this seem like it's a really early game area right now. Have I used the key yet? Or is it just automatically open? Oh, I see. There, That's what I do it for. Okay, another one. Just funny little Voltorb guy. I'm gonna blast. Hit the ball with another ball. Charge beam. Oh boy. Thanks for subbing, friend. Let me run away. Okay, now we can go in. There's a Thunderstone. I'm just gonna go ahead and use... Well, the levels are probably going to get higher when I go down the stairs, so... Ugh. Ryorb. Cell battery. Nothing else over here. Okay, we'll probably find some cool stuff down here, so let's keep the fusion incense going. This is a very different layout than vanilla power plant, that's for sure. Right. Keep forgetting I can't just do that. I did go ahead and... Yeah, you do have the lucky egg. They all play Electrodes Cry. Within its Voltorb, anyway. Arbos, I also see we have the desaturation filter going on here. find some funny fusions. Or not, we could just run into Magnemite again. A Magna Orb. Gonna be seeing a lot of these. Gunnazard is doing just fine. Fantastically, even. Magna Buzz. Ugh. I wonder what Electivire or Magnezone looks like. I kind of probably should try and catch that if I can. Well, there's the weaker version. I'll run into an evolved one again, I'm sure. Let's pick up all these good little items. Hey, yeah, this one's actually an Electrode. Look at that. It can't, af <laughs> it can't boom on me because I'm a ghost type. I like how my sprite got, uh, like, blacked out there. Raichu? Oh. He's so round! Look at that lad! What happened to his arms? He can roll, but he can't hug. How unfortunate. So sorry. Ghost type wins again. The roundest of boy. You know what that Raichu looks like? It looks like one of those bootleg plushies. Like you get it from a you get it from like a crane game, and it's just like uh legally distinct orange rodent. 
Doesn't have arms. It's not Raichu. It's Ryorb. Yeah, cell battery. It's still really weird to me how there's several maps that just have, like, a filter out, like, on top of things. Cha like, just desaturating my character a little bit. And, like, what's the point of that? It's really noticeable what maps do that, <laughs> Pika Orb. We've already seen the evolution of this, so... I think it's supposed to make some areas look darker, but... It's such a weird little thing. I mean, we see- we've all seen the battle menu, we know that the- wait, what? I- I didn't even move! Did I get an encounter on the exact tile that the fusion incense ra incense ran out? I think I did. That was weird. Didn't know that could happen. Genizard's actually pretty good here. Since if they explode, it doesn't affect me. Reflect. Electro Electrorb. <laughs> when Electro uh, when Electrode and Voltorb meet the family for Thanksgiving, Electrorb is the cousin that shows up and says the uh, and says the really questionable stuff that you just kind of keep your head down and grit your teeth until the dinner's over with. <laughs> hey, a Thunderstone. Electromite. Alright, let's do another one. Holy moly. <laughs> Alright, we've seen the whole Pika round family. It's a very round friend. Like a Sveal. Voltorb and Sveal would be cool, but apparently the Sveal family's not in this. Oh, there he is. Cousin Electrorb's back. Come on. I thought we were done with Kaizo for the week. I thought we were done taking three steps and getting another encounter. What's funny is this stuff has, has this stuff exploded on me, too. I'm really burning through all these, aren't I? No baby spiel for some reason. There's no justice in this world. This is the way forward, so I'm going to go up here first. Could max repel, but I still feel like there's things here I haven't seen. Like, there's the Pikamite. <laughs> it's, uh... Wait, but there's... There's five of them. Is it Magnemite and Magneton? Or is it Magneton and Magneton? Not quite. Probably. I don't have enough Magnet Stones to keep the meme going. That's funny. Do it again. Soul battery. Magna Orb. Let's just go on a little adventure. We're taking it easy. I'm still a little bit tired out, but I did really want to stream today. Oh gosh, Electa Orb. I actually had set aside, like, several days last week to do a lot of editing, but I couldn't, like, get anything done. Because my phone, like, for the whole week was just repeatedly going off with, like, alerts about the fire. A lot of areas, like, around me had to actually be evacuated. It was a pretty big deal for a bit. Ugh. Oh, hello, Electabuzz. We can save here, I guess. I could catch that one. Maybe there's an Electrizer around it. Go to B... I kind of just accepted that I'm going to just have, like, some stuff I'm working on delayed for a little bit. It was better to just take a day off. Because I could just not focus and get work done. That's why I didn't, like, get as many stream VODs done and uploaded this past week either. Hmm. Get that. Gyag-yag. 
hey Electabuzz's cry. It's such an annoying sound. Okay, I might kill it actually. Do I have quick balls? I don't have quick balls. But I got ultra balls. I'm worried I might kill it. Okay, now you buffed your uh, special there, so this is fine. Oh, cool. Now use a magical leaf. Oh, cool. Paralyzed. Don't want to accidentally throw the Master Ball at it. Let me get a drink. A cocoa feels good for my throat sometimes. A hot drink in general is good. There we go. Last week wasn't all bad, though. Like, the days I did take off, once I finally got over the fact of feeling guilty that I'm not being productive, I watched a bunch of anime. Uh, no. Give up on that. I finally started watching One Piece, and I got 18 episodes in. Nickname to Electabuzz. No, that's fine. Yeah, that was fun. You just take, like, a whole afternoon and just binge a bunch of anime like I'm in high school again. There we are. Oh, come on. I took one step, and then suddenly there's a Volt Chew. Watching anime is productive? Yes, when you have a good balance of things. Resting is productive when you think about it. But when you're when you're me, you're constantly paranoid about the fact that you've been working on a video for several months, and now I can add to the fact that both a head injury and like uh, wildfires around me have stopped me from like working on it. <laughs> I'm running weirdly. Wait, what? It's not budging, it's not... Oh, this is what I need the batteries for, I see. Oh, I'm sorry, do I not understand what... Okay, there we go. There we go. Magnichu. It doesn't look happy to be alive. I'll put it out of its misery. Slash and pulse him. Going through a lot of these. Zapdos should probably be around the corner here now. Yeah, I know. I can't control all that stuff going on, so it's fine. I'm not too worried about it. Okay. Okay, there's Zapdos. Save the file B. Then also go to A. Can't paralyze you, because this uses like up to Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon mechanics. Hmm. Hmm. Genizard should be fine. Nope. All right, here it comes. The lad. Raise your special defense. See what it does for you. And I'm dead. You can survive a hit, can't you? I might have to restart on this now, won't I? Alright, just eat the Ultra Balls and it'll get in eventually. Maybe, please. Okay. Hang on. Let me go ahead and use a full restore on me. Hit it with a Magical Leaf. Okay, that'll get it to red. And now we just press this. Oh, boy. 
All right, I'm gonna mash the A button. That's a secret trick that catches every time. Damn it, it didn't work. Someone missed the memo. Dardatar can take the most hits easily from you. I caught the other two already. We gotta see what the duo fusions for the birds are as well, because we see what all three of them look like. I'm not sure I can get that particular fusion, though. I'm pretty sure that's just a one-off boss. It really does not want to be caught. You call an Azuma King ugly? How dare you? Azuma King is a king. Respect the huge power. Wow, I would like to get at least more than, like, one or no shakes. That'd be great. Can it even hit Trap Inch now that I think about it? Oh, nice. There we go. Look at you go. Zapdos, a legendary bird that has the ability to control electricity. It usually lives in thunder clouds. It gains power if it's stricken by lightning bolts. It doesn't have Volt Absorb. What a lie. Okay. Now that I've done that, I should be able to just... Oh, I can use Dig in here. I didn't think about that. Alright. Trap Inch saving the day. Damn. Oh, wait. Another Magnet Stone. That, that wasn't there before. Hang on, let me just put you up front in case we get a battle. They regenerate. Okay, that's good. Maybe I can get some Magnezone fusions then. Now that I've caught you... There's all the Sevi Islands. We can go to Knot Island and do that, or we could also just check things out there. Possibly beat Blaine. We'll give Trap Inch a rest for now and just take out that egg. That does sound like fun. Okay, first let's go back here. Let's make a save and let's fuse. Save to file A. You guys love when I do the, the sessions of just fusing random things together. Do it again. And now that we have all three legendary birds, this is going to be fun. Okay, game has been fu uh, saved. Not fused. First, oops, we shall fuse the teddy bear with Zapdos. How dare there not be a custom for this. What about Moltres? Damn. Electabuzz? Oh no, I don't think I'm going to like this. Like Gremlin Bear, I don't like Teddy Buzz. <laughs> it looks like an, the Ursa Ring that couldn't. Electric Bear. Unfuse the Teddy. I said unfuse. May as well just use up the Super Splicers from the menu. It's not like I'm not going to use them. My dude, uh, why don't I go back to box one? Where the hell is everything? Where'd I put the teddy? There's the teddy. Um, Articuno? Oh. 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 The game just crashed. Uh, I got a pop-up window that just says 117. Hold up. Oh, wait, no, no, it, it's still going. It didn't say error, it just said 117. I want a pop-up window. Um. Okay, the game does not, can't do this fusion. Huh? It's because I'm holding a Pokemon? 
Oh, my bad. I misunderstood what I was doing there. Okay, I picked it up instead. I see. Ah, nothing. Nothing. There's no teddy bears to be fused today. Did I see Absol? Nope. Sorry, little bear. No, wait. We gotta put you with the friends in box one. We can't leave you all alone in the desert. Okay, then. Let's fuse the birds. Zapdos and Articuno. Let's do this. Is it okay? An Artidos. Isn't that from Johto? Electric Freeze. Legendary Bird Pokemon Control Ice. It usually lives in Thunderclouds. Confirm. Do that. And now let's reverse it. Now what will this one be? Zapkuno. That one looks cool. I like how the its tail looks like a plug or extension cord there. Reflect. Nah. Okay, now let's unfuse them. What about legendary birds and Cleffa? Uh-oh. That would make a demon too powerful. But first, let's just fuse the uh, the birds together. Pokemon are being fused. <laughs> this looks like they tried to fuse. This one looks like a plane that's on fire and it's about to crash down into the ground. A Moldos. Reverse. A Zaptrus. It's like, instead of flames, it has like electric. Like, uh, what would you call it? Just, like, electricity sticking out of it, I guess? I didn't mean to do that. All right, unfuse them. Now that I've done that, I guess just fuse Moltres and Articuno together. Let's fuse you. I imagine there'd be a lot of things made with the legendaries. It's got blue fire, but it looks like... I know that's supposed to be a beak, but it looks like it's missing a nose. Its head is very tiny for that. Confirm. Reverse. Let me reach up and grab this. That oh, one looks like about what you'd expect, yeah? All right, all combinations of the bird fusions are done. Now let's see if what happens when we put the birds with other stuff. Since the PC, all right. Now what happens when you combine a Cleffa with legendaries? Oh my God, what, what is that? Why, why is this possible? I didn't think they'd actually get drawn. Is it wearing a little crown? It's got- it's a zap buff. It's a little chick now. Alright. You know, just for the hell of it, I want to see the auto one when I reverse it. What did you just walk into? It's- it's a ba it's a baby Kleppa. Uh, and now it's a flesh Kleppa bird. Kleptos. Hey, didn't I have one of those when I combined it with Gyarados? Unfuse. Its skin is stretched out all over the Zapdos' body. There we go. All is right with the world. All right, let's go to the other ones. Uh oh, that has that has something. <laughs> By knuckles three and knuckles again. The legendary fluffy cotton candy monster. Very ice. Now unfuse it. 
A weird ass parrot, that's what you call it? Yeah, probably. Moltres. Uh, where did I put the Kleppa? What's over here? Oh, wait, no, I'm holding it. Damn it, I'm gonna make the same error happen again. Fuse with Moltres. Nope, nothing new. What about Absol? There we go. What is that? A star disaster. Well, it's a disaster, all right. Unfuse it. Is it like a mask? I don't know. The demon. That's what it is. Okay. Take your item, put you down. Let's unfuse you two. All right, now let's fuse Charizard. I believe I saw a Moltres with it last time, right? Thank you, Mayui. Appreciate that. Thank you for the sub. Articuno. Ooh, fancy stuff here. The music always cuts out when you fuse stuff. It's weird. <laughs> This looks like, this looks like something I'd see on Sesame Street. Like, it's Big Bird's, like, uh, distant, like, uncle or something. Artizard. <laughs> Flame Freeze. Now let's reverse it. Wow, that looks pretty nice. From a distance, it almost looks like I'm looking at Archeops because of the color scheme. You don't need wing attack. Now let's unfuse them and check. We saw Charizard with Moltres last time, I'm pretty sure. So let me go to Zapdos now. Ooh, these could be... Look, look at these two shapes. Don't disappoint me. <laughs> this looks like a Charizard painted its body yellow and put on a Zapdos Halloween mask. Like, look, it looks like it forgot to paint its hands. Speaking of Big Bird, <laughs> Zapizard. Confirm. Let's do that there. Now let's reverse it. <laughs> the spikes, the simplicity of the spikes on, on Zapdos's wings just kind of like makes it look goofy there, doesn't it? Get rid of that. All right, now let's unfuse them. Successfully fused. Okay. Now. Who next? Who next? Let me think here. There's so many possible combinations now. A lot of things I can't unfuse now. What do I have with me? Can't unfuse these two because, you know. Hang on. What if I combine Wailord with uh, Snorlax? Good God. What have we unleashed? It's a Snorlord. Now we reverse it. Is all right? Is it okay? It looks disturbed. It looks like it needs a friend. Unfuse him. Before it's too late. Looks like it would make a large bootleg plushie. What about Gengar and Whale Lord? Oh. These could be exciting.
the shadow whale. It's upset. Okay, reverse it. Do it again. I wasn't looking. Oh, jeez. Look at that. Someone put a lot of effort into, like, the shading in the inside of the mouth there. That one's pretty sick. One of the hardest, like, looking, going sprites I've seen by far. Shadow Punch. Oops, no, stop learning things. Stop learning things. Stop learning! You have Dive, but we don't even have the badge for that yet, so it doesn't matter. Unfuse. Look at that thing. So evil. So wild looking. Okay. Something with the bird. You know what would be cool, actually? Hang on. What about Murkrow with the legendary birds? What if they, what if we made Murkrow look cool? First, there's you. There's one. A Murtress. <laughs> I like its little flames there. It looks like parts of its face are missing, though, because of the shape of Murkrow's beak. Flame darkness. All right, unfuse it. It's braviary. Yeah, I can see the color scheme on it, yeah. Now let's go to Articuno. Somebody was drawing fusions with these. It's just... It's just Murkrow's head. It's a little... Close to being an auto-looking one. Freeze darkness. Unfuse again. Okay. Now... There's Zapdos. Nope, nothing for that one. Well, since I have Murkrow in my hand... Nope, no Cleffa. Teddy and Murkrow? If it wasn't for the beak, it would al almost be a little merchandisable friend. A little darkness. Unfuse them, and then we reload. Okay, let me see what else I want to do here. I suppose I could try for alligator with stuff. Hang on. Because this thing right here was an absolute disappointment. What about Gengar and for alligator? These look. This looks like it could be something. Oh, that looks pretty cool. Ursaluna in the name. Gangligator. That one's thumbnail potential right there. I like it. Big shadow. Ghost water. Too bad I already have a way better water physical water type user. Now let's reverse it. I can spend all day just... <laughs> all day just doing this. Yeah, it's me! It's Baragar. Yeah, look at me! Hiya, kids! You ain't punching nobody today. Now let's unfuse it. Looks like a live action cartoon suit. Okay. Articuno. Nope. The silhouettes look kind of sick. Well, the one on the left does, but it's auto. So it's going to be like. Gross and blurry looking. Oh, same. No one cares but for alligator. Oh, 
this one does. Is that a beak sticking out? Oh, God. Here's one. Oh, that's actually pretty sick. Oh, it's by the person who made the, uh, the Gengar fusion. That explains it. They actually made that massive beak actually look cool. Look at that. This, uh, Mammoth Use Ursa Luna person is making some good ones. Zapligator. Okay. Just for the hell of it, I want to see what the auto looks like now. <laughs> so bad when they're auto. Yeah, it's me, Pharados. Look at me. Unfused DNA splicers. I'm running out of DNA splicers. I have like thirty I have like thirty to forty on hand just for these little fuse sessions, but I'm getting carried away. There it's too much fun to just do this. You know what? Hang on, what about for alligator and absol? Ooh, okay. You know what? First I wanna see the auto and then we'll go into the custom. Oh, that looks so bad. I got it. Big disaster. Yeah, it's a big disaster, all right. Now let's reverse it. Okay, its face looks a little scrunched there. I think I se actually, I think I seen this one last time, didn't I? I can't remember actually. All right, unfuse it. Only a couple left. Okay, there's the Shedder stuff. So look at that little friend. Hmm. Only a couple left till we get back to playing. What about... For Alligator Hitmonlee? Nope. Can't waste the splicers on autos now. For Alligator Charizard. We saw that last... Ha did I see these before? I don't think I did these. Let's do this. Oh, that looks pretty good. Charlie Gator. Charlie Gator. <laughs> the neck on that sprite looks weird. Verizard. It's Fiawada. Oops, nope. Unfuse it. I got four splicers left. Just a couple more, then I'll reload and play and catch some more stuff first. Alright, maybe something a little unusual. I'll combine the coffin with and Kangaskhan with more stuff next time. Because those can make good recipes. Ah, uh, for alligator with anything else, though. What about right, you and Nino King? Pardon me. <clears throat> Jeez. Ugh, oh, pardon me. Throw was like it there. Can I get the spider to combine with anything? Because I haven't seen the spider, like, get an original fusion for anything yet. Relax. Nope. Legendary birds I don't think are going to be with Gavantula. Nope. Teddy. Nope. Charizard. What is that? <laughs> it's a Charchula. It's a thing, all right. Okay. Maybe next time do Parasect with stuff as well. Eh, just something random. Electabuzz with for alligator. Nope. Balloons. Nope. What was that silhouette? I don't. I don't like the silhouette on the left very much. I know it's auto. Oh dear. Hitmonlee. Let me see one of these. Can I? 
Let me go to this. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that thing. Kicking electric. And I'll reverse it and that's that. Hitmon Buzz. It looks like what you'd expect, I guess. It wants to double kick. All right, let's finally actually play a video game now. Let me go ahead and go back here. And just go back to title screen. Oh, hang on, I gotta mute the audio. I wanna get claimed again. Don't save. It'd be very bad to save after all that. On the subject of copyright crap, when I was setting up for today's stream, someone claimed the Silent Hill 3 Let's Play. Or the VOD on YouTube. Hang on. They claimed 30 seconds of a random music track and blocked the whole video. So now I have it set to... um try and edit out that 30 seconds so I can keep the video up. And that's always fun. Hopefully by the time I'm done streaming, YouTube will fix that. Be a pain in the ass because I don't want to re-upload that. It's an upload from like last year. Alright, let's go up to Mount Ember. I am pretty sure that Ak Akira Yamaoka is not the one who claimed it. Or Konami. Some generic, like, SoundCloud rapper, like, group or whatever. I think it was, like, CD Baby or whatever, a bunch of random characters. Kill. Every morning before breakfast, I swim around the island. You know, I know I said it in a Silent Hill. I'm, at any moment now, I'm waiting for someone to tell me it's Nintendo that did it. <laughs> That's usually what happens. Alright, kill the Machop. Ma- ma bull. <laughs> ma bull! Gasp, gasp. Look at that. Oh, come on. I feel like I'm going to sneeze now. Keep breathing fire on crap. Let me get a drink here. Ugh. There isn't a day in which we don't train, I'm sure. Hit Monlum. Look at that. Look at that thing. It's weird. I'm gonna launch a Shadow Ball at it and kill it. Okay, it's gonna stealth rock me, but it's not gonna kill me. I'm such a fool. I'll train even harder from now on. You know what I should do, actually? Hang on, I should go back. Carbos. Let me get these open first. Just a level 5 Geo, dude, no big deal. Art scale, nice. And another one. Uh, where's the- there's the cursor. Okay. <clears throat> Pardon me. That cough kind of messed me up. What I want to do is finally take out that egg. I don't need to take you right now. Take the experience share off you. Alright. Hold up a sec. Where did I put the hot egg? Hang on. Okay, I'm good. I had to, like, I actually gag my throat there for a second. This egg will take a long time to hatch, so we'll just put it in the back while we do this. Levitate lucky egg. Nope. Okay. And I will go ahead and just put the experience share on this. Hold up. Yeah, let me stand up for a teensy bit here. Much better, much better, much better, much better. Now let's actually go on a little adventure. Now 
And just like that, I'm already back to where I was. A network adapter. Large boulder fell on the road. Pool of water looks pretty deep. Maybe I could get to the other side by diving in it. Okay. Let me down some water, too. Look at those Corsola. Is there anything else here? Nope. There we go. I feel like I'm gonna sneeze now. I don't need to go back in the Mount Ember Caves. Oh, this is, uh... Yeah, that's how I got there in the first place. I can't seem to really go anywhere else now, can I? Not until I get... Oh, there's a fly gone there. It saves me the trouble of catching one. I don't have strength. I need to go back in the safari zone for that, don't I? Yeah, I guess I didn't get that. I think I need a later badge for that, too. Huh? Oh. Damn, I was getting excited for a second. Thought I could cheese it. Alright, then. Hmm. Go back to Cinnabar. Yeah, this should be fine. Then let the Zuma King re reign free. Hang on, I also got the diamond necklace for this person, don't I? You got the diamond necklace? Here you go. This is it. My wife will look stunning wearing it. Here's the money I owe you. Since you... I'll give you the stone I originally got my wife, too, since I no longer need it. Oh, Helix Fossil. My wife will look like likely with this. You'll truly save my marriage. Were able to recover my stolen relic vase? Right. Pokemon Mansion. Wild Ditto can be found. Hold a metal powder. Find them in the basement. All right. There's probably new things to catch in the mansion anyway, so we can try that. It's spooky in here. I like how it's meant to be dark in here, but it doesn't have the... Oh, God. That filter going on. Oh, come on, I took one step up. Should use the fusion incense, incense here. Okay. Cornet burn heals and working with stuff. Grittata. It's a grimy rat. Imagine if... Why the hell is there just a skybox out there? That That is a very weird decision. <laughs> it's a... Muakate. The only thing that can make rats worse is if they're running around with literal sludge on them. Come to think of it, sewer rats basically do do that, don't they? I... I don't like that. I need- I can't look at that. I can't look at something with multiple rat tails. That just actually sends a shiver down my- through my body. Ow. It's because we're on the second floor, I guess, but like... It's just a very generic cloud.jpg outside the black void. Like... <laughs> it looks weird. I can't get out. This old place is a puzzle. Charmander! This is your future, Charmander boy. Licky Meleon. Ooh. Is it farting out of its tail, almost? Should Dark Pulse. I don't know why I hit that. Oh no, my bag of loot. What? What? What'd he say? Okay, they drop loot when I beat them. That's what that is. The text skipped on its own, I swear. 
Oh my god. Okay, a few more fusions, and I'm using max repels. Seafoam Islands and Crystal Kaizo have irritated me a little too much with the high encounter rates. There we go. Do you guys hear any background noise? I think, like, my neighbor's hammering or something. Okay, so this one goes right to the cloud box without any black tiles on the side. July 10th, we christened the newly discovered Pokemon Mew. Yeah, let's use Max Repels. I... I got an encounter on the same tile that it ran out. So as soon as I used the Max Repel, I got an encounter anyway. There's tons of stuff to loot in here. Only me. Only me can have that luck. That's why you watch me. You see the game fall apart when I play. Pulse that puppy. Slash that puppy. Nidota. Oof. That almost looks good. The problem I have with it is that, like, the head is, like, just, like, copy and paste it from, like, the actual sprite, and it's really noticeable. It looks unnaturally, unnaturally posed. Fire Blast. I've been caught. Oh, there's the Relic Vase. Okay. Calcium. I should use these up if I can. Calcium. Won't have any effect. Alright. Carbos. Won't have any effect. Well, can't use it on them anymore. Locked. Oh, and now there's no skybox, but there's a window. Like, I I'm sorry, this is a bit nit nitpicky here, but like, what is this map design for the outer? <laughs> like, there's no skybox anymore. <laughs> Little consistency, maybe. A successful attempt at cloning Mew, we named the newborn Mewtwo. There's a Magmar just chilling. Not yet. Let me keep looking. Now I'm above the sky, duh. There's a science friend. September 1st, Mewtwo is far too powerful. We have failed to curb its vicious tendencies. Iron. Probably can't use this either. Okay, it worked on him. Can't talk to you. There's a rock there. Who wouldn't? There's three drop-offs here. Great. My mentor once lived here. Good for you. I didn't ask, and I don't care. Maybe I'm in space now. Okay. Send him on fire. Electro ball. Slash him. <laughs> well, damn it. I got ghosted. Send out Azuma King. Nice. Alright, now let me heal up. How many revives I got? Uh, none, apparently. Just the max revives. Oh, great. You know what? I'm gonna use it. Have an ice cream cone. They're delicious. I'd love to get free ice cream. Use up the fresh water, I guess. Use this if you can't find the exit. Escape rope. You're stuck? Try jumping off over there. Does this just lead to the other exit? Oh, it's an item. I potion. Hello, Skybox. You're back. Oops. I hate how the railing blocks me in. Okay. That's a weird drop effect. The drop-off always confuses me because... In Fire Red Leaf Green, the mansion layout is exactly the same, except they change which drop-off takes you to the where you need to go. There we go. Failed attempts at cloning the newly discovered Pokémon. Gelatinous Pokémon was created by mistake. 
Okay, we add in some fan lore there. That's that there. Hold up, can I keep going up? I never would believe that Pokemon could fuse together. That there was a formula like this. Magnish. Set it on fire, it won't live. Magna Plume. Oh, look at it. I hate it. I hate how clever that design is. Magnium. Kill them. I like it here. It's conductive to my study, or conducive. Can I do some more testing? No. Max Revive. Max Potion. Nope. Doesn't seem close to hatching. There we go. Quite a pulse. Oh, come on, that killed it? Is its special defense that bad? Electabuzz was able to take it. Well, whatever, it's just Magmar. Come on, hit the thing. Max Repel use. Can I radar? Yeah, I've seen everything here. I don't need the stuff to catch. Hmm, this next experiment seems very interesting. A Chara. Look at it, chat. It's a Chara! And it's dead now. Dynamic punch, no. Gaster. Alright. Let me put Genizard up front. It's all an under- that person's an Undertale reference, is that why their name is Friss? I have never played Undertale. I probably should at some point, but if I, I feel like if I ever do it as a stream, it would become the most unbearable play, play session ever. For me. I should emphasize that point. Okay, we're in the basement. There's no wild ditto. Oh, that's on the left side. I see. I, I mistook it for another for another Grimer sprite. All right, let's catch a ditto if I can. Who are you? There shouldn't be anyone here. Electra Duck. I don't know why I went for that. Oh, give me a break. Who are you? There shouldn't be anyone here. Oh, you're a scientist, too? How about we conduct more experiments? No. Hey, Blizzard. Hey, catch a ditto now. The rat is punching me, but I have punched the rat back. What's over here? Oh, items? There's a ditto. It's gonna copy my catch rate. This should count enough. fled the battle. I didn't think about that. Ah, that's annoying. I guess if I run into Ditto, I should just yeet an Ultra Ball at it. I don't have any Quick Balls with me. Now, oh, come on. It's a Ratmer! 
It looks like it's giving me the middle finger with one of its hands. I don't like it. Yeah, no. Go Ultra. It transformed. I used to do questionable experiments in this basement before the mansion burned down. Burglar. Oh, what the hell? Ralton. Kill. The puppy's okay. Ah. Gotta go find my partner. 300. That's a whole lot of nothing. Rodents on the loose. Don't need to worry about them. Hang on. It's another Ratmer. Wait, that's supposed to be the Raticate one. Is that just not the exact same sprite, but the eyes are different? And obviously the sludge is brown now. Explosion. Why are you here? It's a cough toe. Why, yes, I'm Blaine, the city's gym leader. This very room where scientists genetically engineered a Pokemon called Mewtwo many years ago. One can only imagine the experiments that took place in this basement, but it has been abandoned for a long time. So you wanted to challenge my gym? Very well, I'm gonna go back to the gym immediately. All right, I guess this makes more sense than me finding a random ass key in the basement that suddenly unlocks the front door of his gym that no one on the inside will unlock. We all just agree how convoluted and stupid that was in Gen 1. Like, it's such an arbitrary way to make you go through the mansion. They could have done like anything else. At the poker flute, only accessible on key items right now. There's no- yeah, there isn't even a single NPC that tells you it's in there either. Hang on. I hate you anyway. Or could do that. Crying out loud. Oh, you're pissing me off. Just die already. I don't even care about the stupid quest. I'll come back with quick balls or something. Either get in the ball or get out of my sight. Do not want to be caught. Let me go over here and see what this is. Still gotta find the darn golden teeth. I might get some stuff in the safari zone to use at least. Get Ultra. Hey, I caught one. Got a rare candy, finally. Can't teleport out, of course. Use the escape rope. Ew. Should be at the top, maybe. Yeah, I got two. I knew I got one from that guy earlier. All right, looking at this now. Golik can still, it's gonna take a while to evolve, but whatever. I guess I could go slaughter Blaine. Just use the Zuma King. Got that dude's relic vase, at least. Hang on a second. Does the Ditto need to have metal powder? It's got quick powder. Don't think that works. To the hotel. I hope people enjoy this island while it lasts. 
Shame the criminal escaped, but I'm glad they had the vase back. Here's something for your trouble. TM recover. I think they just want the item metal powder. Yo, champ, in the making, give me water. Alright, this should be a slaughter. Yo, you need to answer the question on the computer right there to open the gate. Question one. A fusion between Charmander and Ponyta evolves at which level? 16. Correct. Proceed to the next room. But I'll battle you anyway. I was a thief, but I became straight as a trainer. He's got Vulpix. He's gone straight. I can one-shot these lads with anything. Prime Tails. Ooh. Aqua Tail can miss, because 90 accuracy. It'd be better to put Waterfall on. For now, Slash is, is stab and just does absurd amounts of damage. Which of these two... Which of these Pokemon is not Steel-type? Uh... Noah's Pass. Correct. Did you know how hot Pokemon Fire Breath can get? Last time I saw a custom quiz was when uh, the Teddy Ursa mod had a quiz about my own streams put into it. That was fun. They knew more about my streams than me, but I got all the questions right. Or rather, they knew a lot of obscure things. I'm surprised they remembered. Also, that's an abomination against nature. Why do you do this? Why do you put the creepy mushrooms on everything? Yeah, hot, hot. Psychic, or be more precise, combustion, blah, 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 blah. Which type is super effective against a fire grass Pokemon? Big O, I believe it's rock. I just like using fire Pokemon. I like burning stuff. I just like burning stuff. Ivy Meleon. <laughs> it's funny. Reminds me of that one girl from the Weekenders cartoon where she's just like, I like pointy things. <laughs> I like pointy things. And that was her whole character. She just said that. Question four. Fusion with Oddish as the body and Rhyhorn as the head would have which typing? Um... I don't care enough to think about it. You can't win. I'm going to battle him anyway. P Commander. With all these custom what the customs I feel like don't always follow the rule of body and head as closely as they should. <laughs> that. Kill. So half the time I don't even remember what does what. No, you don't need Hydro Pump. P Chameleon. You just got slashed, boy. Wow, my studies. My theories are too complicated for you. Are they? Are they? Let's use up these. How many types are not very effective against fire type? I don't care enough to think about it. That's my answer. That's a lot of moles. Look at them. Some of them are angry. Some of them are upset. Some of them are curious. And some of them, they just want a place to belong. Kill. Whole squad's here. Ow. Blaine was lost in the mountains when a fiery bird Pokemon appeared. Its light enabled Blaine to find his way home. use another potion here. Do I have a super potion somewhere at least? Not really, it seems. Oh, well, I'm going to heal before Blaine anyway, so I'll do this. Which TM move contains Tombstoner? None. Even I know that one. Fire is weak against H2O. Really? I didn't realize that. Growl picks. Look at that. Fancy looking pooch. And now it's dead. Charleth. 
<laughs> Look at a little thing. Snuffed out. Water beats fire, but fire melts ice Pokemon. Okay. Alright, get healed up. Let's go beat up Blaine, I guess. This is the hotel, not the gym. Now we gotta run all the way back here. Ah, I'm Blaine. I'm the leader of the Jindabar Gym. My Pokemon will incinerate all challengers. You better have Burn Heal. Four Pokemon for this fight. And you to get that. Just the experience for you. A glue dash. I don't like that. Level 47 now. Magdon. Oh, jeez. Look at that forehead. Probably rock type now, so just go Aqua Tail. Oh, even your berry didn't help you. Chardactyl. <laughs> I've seen that one. Nine nine. Oh, I get it. <laughs> nine tails and arcane nine. That's it's funny. It's funny. Instead. Ain't nothing living through Azuma King. I have burnt out. You've earned the volcano badge. That was easy. Heightens the abilities of your Pokemon here. You can have this too. Fire Blast. Teach you to a fire type mon. Three premium wonder trade tickets. Okay. I'm not gonna save, we're just gonna take the three Wonder Trades and roll with them. Since I, I can't really... Uh, maybe I might get something useful out of it. Alright, let me get my team out for it. Maybe I will save. Only I'll only reload if they're really, really bad, though. Psyduck, I don't care to keep that, honestly. Let me just put these over here. Ghastly, I've already got Gengar for fusing random stuff now. And Grimer, I've seen enough melted fusions with this. Okay, three premium wonder trades. Save to file B, then we save to another slot at file A. Yes. I thought the game crashed for a second. Alright chat, are you ready? to see something wholesome. Romeo. Oh! It growled in Paris. I hate it. I hate it. It's a palace. Help it. I can't unfuse them. Ma'am, you disappeared. And now you're okay for this? Lime wire. <laughs> this is the worst ones ever. This is the worst use of Wonder Trade I've ever had. This better be godlike. What back? Oh jeez. Why is it named Quebec? That's a location in Canada. Nice looking sprite there, but it's also... It's but it's Butterfree and Mareep, obviously. Looks cute. Or is it Beautifly and Mareep? Nickname... Mafree. <laughs> It's definitely half Butterfree on the bottom there, yeah. Mm, I kind of want to see it evolved, yeah. All right. Let's do that. 
I'll use it. I don't know why the hell it was called Quebec, though. It's so weird. I could reverse these two. That's as far as we'll get to see with them. Wow! It's worse! It's very worth it to train this for the other sprite? Okay. Let's reverse this. I... Why did we have to make Badoof Rat? <laughs> so dumb. Trin... <laughs> now that's definitely auto. You can see... I thought that said bitrate for a second. Its face certainly looks like bitrate. That's yeah, another rat. Stop it. Stop it. I'm trying to not learn. Alright, let's get rid of these. Put them away. We don't like them. Alright, who had the experience share? You did. But you also have teleport, so I gotta take you with me for a second. Take the egg to get steps on it first. I don't need the surf. I think I could train this thing up pretty quickly, so let me go ahead and just, uh, hang on. Take the experience share. Give this to you. Easily get some easy levels here. Move the lucky egg to Genizard. Who have we not beaten up in Kanto yet? I suppose I need- I should probably give you the network adapter. I kind of forgot about that. Uh... Oh, could this be the missing network adapter? Your lifesaver. Here, let me install it. Now the test everything works, I'll transfer some Pokémon from my home region to this PC. It worked perfectly. And thank you for helping us out. I'll give you one of the Pokemon I just transferred from Sinnoh. Oh. 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 Alright, I'll take a free Chimchar. Well now, if you excuse me, I have to go set up the PCs on the other island, so I have to get going. That's good. Free monkey. Modest. Oh, it's modest. That's terrible. Well, no, wait. Infernape's a mixed attacker anyway. This might be something I make a mainstay on the team, provided it has the fighting part of it in the fusion. Because I don't need another fight uh, fire type. I mean, Azuma King is the only thing needed on this team, let's be real, but still. Before I evolve it, we can fuse it with things later. For now, can I go to a different island? Where do you want to go? We're not leaving right away. Okay. So how do I get to the other islands? I guess I gotta do something, figure something out about that later. Oh, that's right. Starters always pass their base type. I forgot about that. There's that area up there. I need to surf for that. I don't go there yet. I still need surf to get around too much, don't I? I can also just go train at the Viridian Gym. Pretty much realize that's open. Yo, champ of the making, even I don't know the identity of the gym leader. What? Is Giovanni? I don't believe you. Anyhow, trainers here like ground-type Pokemon, so you better be careful. Take this. Karate is the ultimate form of martial arts. Is it? Then karate chop me. Morochoke. That thing. This could hurt hard if it hits me. Hmm. It's probably gonna... Wait, no, I can't ground type me. I'm, I have levitate. Uh, I thought the game crashed for a second. I had a mini heart attack. 
What's going on? Why is Flamethrower just, like, freezing the game? Electro Ball. No. Supersonic. No. I'm a freeze of all the... Fluffree? Flaffery. <laughs> oh, that's a cute sprite. Look at that one. Stop learning things. Birdie and Jim was closed for a long time, but now our leader's back. Neato Slash. There, now it's working fine again. Ampharos happens at level 30, right? Also, look how baller this thing is. Safeguard. Nope. Nope. Sandhorn. Hmm. You're just on the team so we can see your final sprite. We don't gotta give you moves. Your Pokemon will cower in fear when I'm done with you. Will they now? Engineer Cole. Sandbok. Look at that. That's what Sandaconda should have looked like. Sandaconda line looks kind of lame, if you ask me. The frickin' snakes would just look like the inflatable tube around them. Ryros. <laughs> Little silly looking. Oh, right. Can't do that. Stone Edge. There you go. Youch! Wait, I was careless. The truly talented win with style. Well, you ain't gonna be winning this one. Weeping horn. Look at it. Is it like broken apart? Okay, maybe after this battle. No, stop trying to learn whirlwind. Stop trying to learn confuse ray. Marowak. That's just a lowland Marowak. I guess it's that's what you get when you combine two Marowaks together. That would be one way to implement it. It doesn't seem like it's ghost type, though. It's probably ground fire. I don't know. Rat Queen! Rat Queen! Oh, I hate it. I hate it. Kill it. Burn the rodents. Bug Buzz. Yeah, sure, why not? Lost my grip. What's Flaff for er, Ampha Free gonna be? Oh, look at that! It's a little friend. Those are some good sprites for it, at least. Learn Gust. Thunder Punch. Nah, you don't need the. You're going to the PC forever, bro. Let me get that item. Revive. It's a little teddy friend, that's right. Alright, we used it. We evolved it. And now we don't need to worry about it. Don't need to train the Chimchar yet, because again, I want to fuse it with stuff first. Take the experience share. What else we got for training up here? That I could go for. The Barrel Rat. Evolved pretty quickly, wouldn't it? But can't combine them with other stuff. There's Kabuto. I could start training my dude. I didn't get this. Hang on. Okay, I caught got this from an egg, so I can unfuse them later. Cause Machamp with a bunch of stuff would be cool. It's time to let my dude grow. Doesn't seem close to hatching. You three can do this. Maybe for Alligator and, um... Maybe for Alligator and Infernape would be cool. I don't know. I'm just spitballing here. Okay. Seems fine. Let's get back to it.
I am the Karate King. Your fate rests with me. He's gonna lose and cry about it. Okay. Set things on fire. I'm gonna need Azuma King. Hang on for the gym leader itself. Gonna need to learn a bunch of stuff. Karate Chop. Nope. 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 Yeah, sure. You can learn that. You can learn that. Fine, you can learn that. I'm about to send in my king. <laughs> so tiny. It's just a little goblin wearing underwear. It's bulking up. Sorry, you're too tiny. Why is it so tiny when Needle King and Machoke are huge? Stop learning moves. Okay, goal choke. <laughs> It's a muscle duck, all right. Sure, learn knockoff. See if I care. Maybe who knows? Maybe my dude will be end up being godlike. What's its? It's a hasty nature, so it gets a speed up, defense down. Doesn't really matter too much because you're already part. You got the golem body or the geodude body. Who knows? This is just. This is the spin animation. It's me walking forward while sometimes, like, looking to the left. Pokemon and I, we make wonderful music together. Engineer Jason got a Purhorn. Ooh. You missed the target. Uh-oh. Not par flying type. Can't kill me one hit. Bulldoze. Yeah, sure, why not? Learn moves. Roar, I'm working myself into a rage. He shouldn't be raging. I just realized something, actually. Um, for fighting Giovanni, I may be a fire type, but Genizard has levitate. So I can't be hit by one of my biggest weaknesses anyway. Star Swine? Okay. That... something all right. Not still part psychic, it seems. Go for it. Go for it. There you go. Star you melted on its head. Well, star me melted. My dude is not self-destructing. We, we believe in self-confidence here, not self-destruction. I'm still not worthy. All right, is that about everyone? No, there's still one more dude back there. Let's just beat him and go heal. Next time I'll be able to go to the Elite Four, I guess. I'd say that would mean I could put the Elite Four in the thumbnail, but the way I format the thumbnails is I just put a funny fusion in the middle because I've already done so many thumbnails that use like all the different art. Hang on, of the trainers. Apparently that seemed to work. The algorithm loved those rainbow thumbnails. There we go. Don't need vital through Joltnix. Oh, what's he doing to my boy? Got Thunderstone in there. Break it. Licky whack. Wait, what? Is that supposed to be Lickitung and Marowak? Why is there, like, an onyx tail popping out of his head? Oh, it's a lagging tail? I, I guess. That's supposed to be in place of a bone? Kind of a weird choice. Hindler. <laughs> Funny little name. He's swords dancing. 
It looked like it was popping out of its head. Not that he was holding it, though. Stealth Rock. Nah. I ran out of gas. My dude is evolving. Say goodbye to my dude. Say hello to... Malar. <laughs> Alright. He looks happy. That's what matters. I think. Alright, let's go beat up Giovanni. Heal me up. Okay, one more level would probably give me... That, that's okay. I should probably lead with Azuma King. Easiest way to sweep. I love how after I got Gardetard level 55 to see the Evo, I just don't even- I haven't even needed to use it. These three are great. I actually don't know if I want to unfuse Genizard, like... It, it- Ghost Fire is pretty cool, and it has Levitate. Pretty good moves. Not seeing a reason to unfuse them. I don't think anybody wants me to go back to the Mr. Mime fusion that I used for most of the playthrough. I haven't gotten a Dusk Stone. I still could make something with Aegislash, Slash, but it probably would be weird. I don't know why, but I'll save. There we go. The, the lights in my room just flickered. Uh, is that rain outside getting a little more intense? Good golly. Hello, friend. Welcome. I plan to resurrect Team Rocket here, but you have caught me again. So be it. This time I'm not holding back. Choose your five strongest Pokemon. Five? Oh, I guess I'm taking them all. Once more, you shall face Giovanni, the greatest trainer. Riparis. That's a pretty cool looking sprite. Uh, is it going to be Ice? Or maybe Brick Break would do more in that case. Because I don't want to miss... Good enough. Okay, it's setting up a sandstorm. That's its goal. Well, you can only do that for a few turns. You should probably lead with a sandstream Pokemon. I'm just making him use up all his full restores right now. This is fine. Huge power, baby. Go champ. Golem and Machamp? Is he about to spoil the Madude evolution? He really is a villain. I can't believe this. I cannot believe what we're all seeing. Well, he's going to spoil the reverse. So if it's going to be Fighting Rock, I guess I could just go right for that. Damn. Turn Golem's like armor into muscles. That's kind of a clever design decision. Still, kill it. 57. Stealth Rock. Nah. Glycitar. Glyscore and Tyranitar? Oh, damn. That's pretty sick. It's actually really pretty sick design. I like that. What type is it? Uh, Aqua Tail is probably my safest bet anyway. Huge power with Slack King's attack, baby. That's how what we got. Dual Chop. Dragon coverage. I don't know if I'll even need this, but why not? Elect Electa Trio. Doug Trio and Electabuzz? <laughs> why do they have the arms? Okay. Yeah, go ahead, light screen. See what that does for you. Rylax. <laughs> okay. Keeping with the, the Fire Red Leaf Green theme of his final Rhyhorn related thing being unevolved. There we go. Let's go an Earthquake. Always funny how in Gen 1 his ace is Rhydon, but in Fire Red Leaf Green they gave him two Rhyhorns instead. I do not know why they did that. Even Let's Go gave him his Rhydon back again. Malar is evolving. Okay. Still called a Malar, but now it's part Machoke. 
Having lost, I cannot face my underlings. Team Rocket's finished. Yeah, cool. I did it. It's great. Fun. Enter the Pokemon League is my gift for your Pokemon League challenge. Oh, nice. Earthquake. Make your opponents beg for mercy. I made it when I ran the gym here too long ago. Three Wonder Trade tickets. All right. Hang on. Earthquake is huge. Let me just, uh... There it is. I think I should get rid of Brick Break for Earthquake at this point. Faint Attack at least still covers, uh... Faint Attack can't miss and covers the Psychic types. So, yeah. There we go. May as well put it on you over Bulldoze if I end up using you. Nice. Now hatch on that. Music faded out. Is the music coming back? There it is. Alright, I got all the badges. Two gyms in one go. Now, I want to have time for Purity Forest today. Like I said, I started pretty late, so I'm probably not going to go an entire three hours, but... Let me... I want to evolve... Uh, into the Golem Machamp thing. How could I go beat up? I suppose there's the trainers around there. You know what? I'm gonna try and beat the Surf Dude. Because it's getting annoying having to think about having to Surf and Pokemon with me. I should really just bite the bullet and get this out of the way. Let me go back to... Let me go to base speed. This might make it a little easier for me. Usually I play at plus one. Oh. I... I have to have a Surf user with me. Hang on. Didn't think about that. Organize, infuse. Alright, let's just take the egg. Get the Whale Lord. It's apparently dip very tight to get this done, but I'll need to. Everything feels like I'm playing in slow motion at base speed now. No! Okay. Now he's suddenly a lot slower. Even though I know I'm playing at a different game speed, I feel like the game speed, if you play it on speed up, he goes faster than the, your multiplier or something. Why is it so easy now? He was very clearly moving way faster than my character before. Well, whatever. Boost the speed again. Like, I go- when I was- I was- ugh, let me try and talk again properly. When I was at plus one speed, it felt like he went to plus five. Surf without having to use Pokemon. Pretty convenient, right? Alright, well, whatever. Oops. All right. I don't need to carry you around with me anymore. That's fine. Um, you know what I should do? I still need to get strength from the Safari Zone. Well, or rather, I have to find the gold teeth from the Safari Zone, because I never found those, right? Yeah. Okay. He is looking for them, right? No, you're just Jasmine's house. Hello, my name... Did I call her Jasmine? I called her Jasmine, didn't I? I think I did earlier in the episode, too. Janine. Damn it, I'm like the Fire Red Leaf Green translators now. I'm the daughter of Fuchsia, Fuchsia City's uh, gym leader, and I believe we've met already, haven't we? Oh yes, I remember. You're that kid who cleared the way to Fuchsia City by using his polka flute. That was impressive, by the way. Here, I want to give you this. Oh! Well, you know what? Mystery solved. I guess I don't need the gold teeth. Someday I'd like to become a gym leader like my father. 
Well, happy coincidence. There's a Mr. Mime there. Sorry, no Dratini friend today. Alright, I got strength. That covers that. I suppose I could just put strength on the golet since I'm carrying that thing around with me right now. Maybe later we can get a Dragoomen. A little Dragonite friend to combine with things. Alright. Now that I've gotten that done... Uh, let me go here and beat up some trainers right quick. Just to evolve my dude. Let's move this back to Genizard. Should be plenty of friends to rematch over here. He gave me a free pearl for some reason. There's no warden here to help, I guess. I guess having Pokemon Bell is more fun to use that kind of fabric you're wearing to have a rematch. Let's do it. Alright. Mm-hmm. Look at that Polystir. Hex. Nah, you don't need that. Beat him again. Maybe I'll have the Polyrath version. What level is this? Only 34? Oh, it's gonna need a lot more training. I thought it was like level 38 for some reason. I think level 40 is where uh, the trade evil kicks in. Hmm. If that's the case, I'll go battle... Let's just do the rival fight on the side here. I got strength anyway. I didn't get that TM. Bulk up. What? Asprey, what a surprise to see you here. You're going to the league? You collect all the badges. That's cool. And I'll whip you, Asprey, as a warm-up for the league. Come on. Alright. Whatever type it is, just kill it. It just tried to hit me when I have Levitate. Stupid, silly, silly Pokemon. Maghorn. Ooh. I don't like it. How much of a lava lamp it is. Ooh, you're gonna regret that. Electados. Remember that. Ooh, it's got Crunch. But I got Shadow Ball Sweep. How cute? Oh. That's a cool looking sprite, honestly. Weird combination. Star Kazam. Oh, man. That thing certainly went a strange route. Kill it. Ah, oh, it's confusing me. Yeah, super kills. Blastosaur. Or Blastosaur. He still doesn't have the fully evolved starter for both both uh, sides. They're really saving that for the end. He could have it. That Starmie Alakazam gave Dylan heaps of trouble. You mean the one I just killed right away? <laughs> oh, I got no trouble with it. Don't worry about me. Just slaughtering them. That loosened me up. I'm ready for the league. You need more practice, but hey, you know that. I'm out of here. Smell ya. The one in the final fight. Oh, okay. We'll get to him. Well, there's more to do in this game than after, um... Ugh. There's more to do in this game after I beat the champion, for sure. Doesn't seem close to hatching. I want to see this thing evolve. I gotta get a few levels higher.
can't really go anywhere else here, but I could finally use strength from the boulders and get that fly gone. Let me heal. We hope to see you again. You will see me again, probably a thousand times. I don't want to accidentally kick the sand castles down. That wouldn't be very wholesome. We're over here now. What the hell is this? Welcome to the Battle Factory. Each battle you win gives you factory tokens. You can exchange some extra by winning five battles in a row. You don't use your own Pokemon here. The organizers will lend you to use them in some instead. Okay. Okay, so it's just like the Battle Factory from the Battle Frontier. I don't know. Kind of random to just find this here. Alright, I guess. Okay. I'm playing an updated version. <clears throat> Jeez, sorry. That kind of snuck up on me. I need a drink here. Oh, jeez. Aperta. My throat has been a bit iffy the past few days, hasn't it? Hold up a sec. I think I'm gonna sneeze now. Okay, I think I'm all right. Hmm. Let me see if I can get this thing now. Okay, it's level 45. Can't earthquake me. Hmm. Yeet Ultra's at it. Oh, nice. Caught it right away. Yep, I just fixed my seat there, and I did take a good drink. I really needed one. Okay, so since I beat uh, the rival before the Victory Road, next episode should be me going to Victory Road. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to catch a few things, and we're going to end on a long session of just fusing things for fun. Uh, how's that sound? I think that'll be all right. Wait, what? Am I supposed to be able to go through that? I guess so. All right. Mm -hmm. Pearl. Okay, there's the Corsola. I don't have Dive, wherever that's from. I feel like I should be able to breeze through, like, a lot of this game now, especially since I got Azuma King. Let's see if we can fuse something with Chimchar to find something that'd be worthwhile to take with us. Why is there a sign over there? Guess I can't see that without the Corsola. All right. I caught the fly gone, so that's probably good enough. Let's just head to Cinnabar. Oh, right, I have the three... I have the three uh, premium Wonder Trade tickets. Hang on. I can get rid of this thing. Like, I want it. Let me go ahead and make some space here. I might just evolve this thing next time, because it's going to need a few more levels. Alright, take three pieces of garbage. Two of them are what I got last time. I'm never, gonna, I'm never going to use this, let's be real. I can't even unfuse it either. Alright, here we go. Okay. Save to file B. Save to another slot. Go to A. Hang on a second. Save to A. Go back to B again. I don't make the same mistake, I hope. Alright, let's get some random stuff. Trade line wire away. Yeah, sure. Send it out. Albert sends goo. 
I hate it so much. Oh boy. There we go. Dude sent me the goo. The goo. Goodbye, Romeo. Uh, Scott sends Tebow. It's Wooper and Arbok. There we go. Wait for it to pop back into existence. Now we send out the dolphin. Cheaty. <laughs> okay. Shelder and Duck. The beak is Shelder's ton uh, tongue. That's actually kind of clever. Look at that. I could probably evolve some of these for funsies, but whatever. Alright, now we double save again. Oops. Go to A. Alright, we're officially saved, so now we're gonna mess around with random fusions and call it an episode. Are you ready? I'm ready. We caught quite a few things. Chimchar. Flygon? Nope. Absol? Nope. Moltres? Nope. Articuno? Nope. Is anything have anything for Chimchar? Zapdos? Nope. Cleffa? Oh, damn it. What is that thing? It's a chimfa. <laughs> what is that little baby monkey thing? The star chimp. Unfuse it. Use the super splicer up. Chimchar was sent to the PC. All right, give me my Chimchar back again. Fuse it with... Teddy bear? Nope, no bears. Umbreon? Yeah, why not? Take a look at it. Looks better than I was expecting. A Chimreon. Moonlight Chimp. Unfuse it now. We have so many of these. So many of these! Come on, chimp. What can you combine with to look cool? Actually, you know what? Hold up. Stop fusing. Let me unfuse for alligator and the thing next to it. Unfuse you. 37 splicers. Oh, geez. This one actually makes something. Another ghost fire type. I can't run with this, but... Oh, that actually looks pretty cool. A coffee char. Okay. The chimp coffin. They pretend to be elaborate coffins to teach lessons to grave robbers. Its fire is put out when it sleeps. The demon monkey. It's a pretty neat one. Can I make spider monkey? It'll just have like the color scheme of Spider-Man. Damn. That'd be a cool idea. Angus gone? Nope. Nobody has love for Chimchar, apparently. What about Slugma? Make Super Magma Monkey. Well, that really is Slugma. In the shape of Chimchar, I guess. Unfuse! 
Next time I'll have to put it into Infernape and I'll see some better stuff. What about Chimchar and Feraligator? Nah. Nah. Snorlax. No. Wailord. Golet. Why is... I didn't expect this one to actually have something. Alright, why not? Thanks for the sub there, friend. Yeah. It's a Gochar. Chimp Automaton. Alright, there doesn't seem to be a whole lot for Chimchar. What about Flygon? Flygon's a favorite for stuff. Ooh. Oh, that's pretty cool. Mystic Coffin. Now we unfuse it. Its wings are the little goofy hands. What about Kangaskhan? What? You have a fusion for this? Okay. Oh, damn, it looks pretty cool. There's multiple Jotix crawling around its body. That's cool. Galvancon. Parent Tarantula. Yeah, at least it didn't make it so that the pouch is like a spider egg sack. That would be very unnerving. It's a pretty good one, yeah. What about Absol? Ooh. This could be cool. Alright. That's a fly soul. It does look like them the two of them put together. Disaster Mystic. Now let's reverse it and see what it becomes. It's an ab gone. That looks cool. Kind of a skinny dragon. Stop learning moves. Now we unfuse them. He's got cool glasses. Uh, what about... Chimchar couldn't evolve with the or go with the legendaries, but did I catch anything else that I could really put with the legendaries? Well, I could try Flygon with the birds. Alright, there's one. That still mostly looks like Moltres. I except with like the eye cover. And I guess the tail. All right, use it now. What about Articuno? <laughs> Articuno's beak makes everything look kind of weird. Artagon, the Mystic Freeze Pokemon. Okay, unfuse it. All that's left now for that is Zapdos. Ooh, there's two of them. <laughs> the goofy eyes. The legendary bird Pokemon. Okay. Unfuse them now. Oh, no. I meant to reverse it. I didn't see the other one. No, stop that. Oh, jeez, that one got a lot of shading on it. Look at it. It's almost like a peacock sitting down. Okay. What about in the party here? It has thick fat. From Albert. It's got, like, paintballs on its tail. 
I should reverse this, because why not? It's a smearrill. <laughs> it's a paint, little painted egg. That's a good sprite, at least. Now, how about we reverse this thing? Uh-oh, this is going to be auto, isn't it? No! It's a Wubok! It's a Wubok. And I hate it. Crunch, you're not biting anything. You got no teeth. And just for the hell of it, let's reverse you. It's a cider. Same idea of using the, the beak as the tongue. It works. There's the tail of Teddy Puff. Let's unfuse these and see what Lick a Tongue and Parasect can make now. I feel like Parasect can make some real freaking grotesque crap. What about the legendary birds? Oh. Mulsec, the mushroom's on fire, but it just has Moltres' regular ass head just, uh, poking out. Mushroom flame. Unfuse, there we go. We're about to see something really unholy now. Uh, okay, did Moltres, Articuno has nothing. Zapdos is in box three now, isn't it? Where the hell is Zapdos? I still left it fused, didn't I? Alright. Oh. Let me unfuse Zapdos after this and see what this is. Good god, look at that. It's a Paraligator. Oh damn, then even the name works for it. That one had a lot of work put into it. I like how the mushroom looks like it's gripping his back like that. Okay, hang on. Let me find... Yeah, you're down here. I'm running out of DNA splicers. Apparently, I need to start having, like, 50 on hand for these little fusion sessions. Unfuse, yes. Kind of creepy cool, yeah. Because the best part about these fusions is I can see them for five seconds and then I can just put them in the thumbnail anyway. Because they look, the whatever looks coolest just gets in the thumbnail. Or most eye catching, I suppose. Um, Zapdos. Yeah, that's what we want. Oh, there's two of them. Okay, let's start with the small one. <laughs> what is it? Is it okay? Its eyes are popping out. Reverse. Oh, God. Now that's the kind of, like, infected monster I was looking for. It's a Parados. No, it should stop growing. Look at that. Unfuse it. It's diseased. It's a monster. Alright. What about Paris and you? Oh, jeez. This sprite looks like it had a lot of detail. That's definitely something custom. Let's start with this one and then reverse it. What is that? It's like the coffin parts turned into a shape of Parasect. A weird idea. I see the eyes there. All right, now let's reverse it. Is it going to be buried alive? Oh my god. <laughs> Look at that one. There's like freaking spores breaking out of the coffin. That's kind of sick. Scary face. I it should have that naturally. Unfuse it. Unfuse it. Unfuse it. 
The mushrooms are breaking free. They're coming. Alright, what if I fuse it with Kangaskhan? Will that make something creepy? Do I want to see this one? Sure. Oh my! There's a little baby Paris on its head! Unfortunately. The spores are... Oh, jeez. You know what I just realized? You know those, like, the white parts that are sticking out from the top? I've actually read about this. There's, like, a... There's, like, a, a parasitic fungus. I think it's a fungus. Where, like, um, it infects a caterpillar. And it, it kills the caterpillar. And the fungus, like, sprouts from the head. Like a, like a little branch like that. That's what that's based on, I think. Parent mushroom. There we go. Now let's unfuse it. I'm running out. What about Paris and Absol? Will that make like a disaster? There we go. I'm pretty sure like um it, the fungus sprouts from the head like that because the caterpillars in question, like, they're usually underground, so it's trying to, like, get it, the spores to get above ground to blow elsewhere. Uh-oh. Let's see it. Nature is terrifying. Yes, it is. We're all doomed. Oh, jeez. It's a, <laughs> it's a parasol. <laughs> I like that. We should name that- that should be the name of, like, a company that researches this kind of fungus that turns things into zombies. I like the name, Parasol, like that thing you carry around, like- like an umbrella. Yeah. Disaster Mushroom. Unfuse it now. This is Pokemon, like, zombies now! We're all afraid of the fungus. Okay, what can I go for now? I don't suppose the spider gets anything. Oh, wow, it does. Some of these Paris ones have some neat sprites. Oh, that's pretty cool. Paratula. Unfuse. I'm about to run out of DNA splicers again. I might have to just run to the mart and buy a whole bunch more just for the hell of it, because this is I'm, this is what I'm doing before I end the episode anyway. Um, Oopsie. Whale Lord? Ah, oh, damn, no. That's gonna be cool. What about Paris and Gengar and Charizard? Hang on. Place... Take the item. I'm about to run out. Yeah, I need to run to the Pokemart and buy a whole bunch of them. Can't unfuse these. Unfortunately. Let me just go buy some. Oh, there's the Mart. Need to start carrying a whole bunch of those on me, huh? Okay, Charizard with Parasect. That's a pretty interesting shape, Sprite. Let's see what it makes. Can't really see all the big mushroom in the back. That looks cool. Front half, it makes it look like a crab. The flame mushroom. I like it, though. Now let's unfuse it. The wings are torn. Alright, Gengar and Mushroom. Who's the one in control here? There's two of them. Oh, dear. It's a Paragar. <laughs> Now let's reverse it.
It's a, it's not a genus sex. I didn't think about the name. It's a gen sect. Mom, can we have genus sect? We have we have genus sect at home, honey. Channel punch. All right, unfuse it again. The genus sect at home. Let's reverse this just for fun. Oh, is it gonna be auto? No, that's pretty nice. It's a butteros. <laughs> Stop learning things. Why do you keep trying to learn? All right, what else can I fuse the mushroom with? Let's find out here. Slugma? Ugh. Slug sect. It's pretty terrifying to look at. Pokemon see it be infused, see themselves be infused with Parasect. They're gonna die. Like, they're just dead when that happens, right? Probably. Did I see it with Feraligator? Oh, I did. Okay. Uh, birds. Oh, jeez. That's a... That's a clever idea. Kind of upsets me, though. Oh, no. Look at that. The other one's afraid. It's spreading. I, I kind of want to see the Dodrio of this. I should probably evolve the Doduo later. Are known to infest the roots of large trees. When threatened, it flees. He's taking... Oh, okay. Unfuse now. Before I get a Dodrio next time. Okay, they're back to normal. We'll just make them have two heads. Nope. Nope. Probably Dodrio might have something with them. Nope. I don't know, Cleffa? This looks like it's going to be stupid and goofy, so sure. <laughs> it's a Dofa! <laughs> what the fuck is that? I don't know. It's a fluffy friend. I should combine Lickitung with stuff now. Nope. Why are there two for this? Sure. <laughs> that looks exactly what it needs to be, yeah. Licking jaw. Reverse it. Give it that old play the Uno reverse card. <laughs> Little goofy. I don't like how fleshy it makes the Feraligator look. Unfuse it. What about Lickitung with the coffin? Let's see this goofball. That's pretty good. Spooky. Unfuse. What about Lickitung and Absol? Nothing. Lapras, nothing. Shelder? I've seen that one before, but what about Big Tongue? Big Tongue. Is big tongue. All right, where is Paris again? There it is. What about with you? Oh god, this is about to be some horrifying crap right here. Ugh. Okay, it's by that person again. It's a parallax. Ha 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 ha! Funny. 
It's sleeping while the mushrooms grow on it. It's such a spooky little friend. How could you hate it? I did see what those and I got that. Crap inch. Why not? It's alright. It's gonna be fine. It's not dead, probably. Oh wait, it's an ant, so yeah, it is probably dead with this kind of fungus on it. About to crawl on the top of a plant so a bird eats it. What about execute with this? Uh, not what I was expecting in this shape. <laughs> okay. That's, that's an idea. Crack an egg on top of it. Unfuse again. I think Teddy has any. No, Teddy had nothing. Cadabra. Nah. Jigglypuff. Nah. Shockle. Well, these look funny. It's sprouting out of the mushroom now. It's a shoe sect. Mushroom mold. Reverse. Good golly. Everything is just sprouting from, like, Shuckle's rock. Creepy looking thing. I'm already getting low on the splicers I bought. Elephant. Oh, no! No! Poor baby. It's a parappy. Unfuse it again. What else have I not? You know what I can do, actually? I should unfuse these and let them combine with some stuff. That could be fun. Uh, where the hell they all go? Mr. Mime. The Parasect. Good golly, let's see them. Mr. Sect. Okay. Reverse it now. Mmm. It's a paramime. I don't like how his fingers are like the little claws. They're all droopy and crap. Oh boy! No, not reverse. Unfuse. Unfuse now. Okay. I've done that. What about Mr. Mime and the legendary birds? Oh, yes. Let's see something silly. <laughs> Mo Mime! Everything has a fusion with Mr. Mime. Everything. Oh, Mr. Triss. Mr. Triss. Oh, boy. Disgusting. Unfuse it. What about Mr. Uno? Oh boy, they're both gonna be silly. Oh! Oh, Mr. Kuno? Okay. That- wait, that's custom? No, those are- that's blurry. I thought I saw a green. That's definitely not custom because of the blur.
Oh, both of them were were uh both of them were green. Okay, I guess I must be blind right now. My bad. Yeah, they were both gray. Okay. Well, they look goofy. Ah. Uh, all right, that's all we're getting out of those ones then. Stop using. Okay, what about with Drifloon? Nope. What about with Dublade? No. There's gotta be one more abomination. You know what I could do actually? Hang on. Mr. Mime with Absol. Nope, isn't one for that. Is it one for that? Did I see Mr. Mime and Gengar? Yeah, I did see those last time. Mr. Mime and Whale Lord. Oh, okay. These will be the last ones, and then we'll call it an episode. You ready? You ready? You ready? I'm about to see something silly. <sighs> Why Mime? Just a barrier whale mon. And now we reverse. <laughs> Mr. Lord, that's actually a clever idea. It looks good. More effort than Mr. Lord deserved. It's dabbing, I suppose technically it is, if you but it's a whale, so kinda hard for it to do that. Ten out of ten, Mr. Lord. Okay. You know what? Just for the hell of it, I'll reverse this. Is this gonna be auto? <laughs> Grave choke. Grave choke. You know, stop learning. Actually, you know what? I kinda wanna see him a choke in Paris, if that does anything. Okay, then. There's a parachoke. Well, there you go. There's one more nightmare for you guys to have. Superpower mushroom. All right. That was... <laughs> Joel had an auto Mr. Lord, so someone made that. Is that why? Okay. That was quite spooky, wasn't it? I should walk outside where there's music. All right, so I probably spent a good while doing that, didn't I? But that's okay, because fusing things in this game is fun. Um, unfortunately, I feel like I used up a lot of the good ones, so I gotta catch some more mons next time if I can. Maybe take a look at some of the routes. But anyhow, blah, blah, blah. oh, I can't talk. Throat's still a little sore. Anyways, this is where we're gonna stop this. I'm gonna switch over to some Purity Forest on Twitch here. For watching on YouTube, this is where it stops. I hope you're all still enjoying this series. It's been quite a lot of fun to play. Quite a lot of fun to just turn on and mix and match some mons. But anyhow, this is where it stops for you. Have a good night. Bye-bye.